Thanks for joining us on the John Mandola Show. We are driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Center. Let's talk Wilkshire University women's soccer. Joining us is the head coach, John Samoski. Well, John, here we are getting ready for another season, and I'm uh, sure you're excited, as always, about your team. Yeah, John, thanks for having me. It's always an exciting time of the year. Um, you get you know, a bunch of new players. Uh, this year we're replacing some players and trying to figure out our midfield, so that's always exciting trying to figure out who's going to fit those roles in such a key position. Um, we have a lot of returners. We had a decent amount of success last year, so I'm really excited to see where uh, these three seniors can take us um, going into preseason here. It's gone pretty smooth so far, so uh, I am definitely um, optimistic. Well, you talk about the competition in the uh, Middle Atlantic Conference. Uh, there's some great competition, no doubt about it. Uh, tell us about uh, stacking up against some of the other teams. Well, we've always uh, we've always been competitive, and and we we expect to be competitive every year. It's um, you know there seems to be over the last two or three years a uh, new team popping in here and there that uh, just kind of shows a new hand. And um, last year it was Kings, and and the sale they felt was very strong. Misericordia has been a perennial powerhouse, so they're always someone that we're gunning for. Um, it, it is going to be competitive and it's always, it's always tough to make that final four, but we've, we've had, uh, some pretty good luck and, and been very competitive in the past. Well, it seems like, uh, the women at Wilkes, when you see them, uh, not necessarily playing soccer, they're a close knit group, uh, you know, whether they're working the concession stand during the winter or they're hanging out to, together somewhere, uh, these young ladies, they, they, uh, play as a team and it, it, it goes both on and off the field. Yeah, definitely, John. We um, actually uh, we're at Camp Kresge right now doing some team building for a day and a half just to get away from soccer a little bit, rest their legs. Um, you know, we we go through quite a bit of team building through the year, and uh, teamwork is one of our core values, and, and we do, um, you know, place a lot of emphasis on working together to accomplish our goals, not just on the field, but in the classroom and in the community. John, when you talk about uh, hitting the recruiting trail and getting some players in, uh, talk about you know the mix that you get. Uh, do you tend to get some local talent there at Wilkes, or you know you're, you're working all over the place, whether it's Pennsylvania, New Jersey, New York, or Maryland, to to get young ladies in there that want to play soccer and play at a high level? Yeah, we're kind of you know we're, we're within generally speaking within three hours of here. We we pull most of our young ladies, and um, you know Route 81 has been really good to us. We haven't. We haven't gotten a lot of uh, local kids um, recently. Uh, the last one here this year as a freshman is um, Emily Sutton from Lake Lehman, who's had a great preseason for us. Um, but, uh, yeah, down in the Harrisburg area, we've done done pretty well. And in the you know, uh, Schoolkill area, we've done pretty well. John, when you talk about the, the schedule this year, uh, you know, uh, it's a one-game approach, I'm sure. But, uh, you know, I, I know they get fired up for Misericordia. As you mentioned, Kings was improved last year, so that's going to be good too. But uh, it's hard not to get up for, for every game you have and uh, a great facility over there at Wilkes as well. Yeah, we um, we we always try to schedule tough, John. We, You know, like last year, we've always, we've always had Cortland on the schedule. Last uh, non-conference game of the season last year we had Rowan Stockton, and um, you know this year we've we've got uh, Stevenson on the schedule, who's in the top ten in the region. Um, you know, along with some of the top contenders in our conference who are nationally ranked, like Misericordia. Um, but uh, we we start off you know pretty tough with Muhlenberg and Moravian, and then turn around a week later and go up to. Uh, play Union and, and UMass Boston, who were both regionally ranked last year. So I try to keep it competitive so we don't get too complacent and rest on our laurels so we're ready for those tougher teams in the conference. John, how about the breakdown of this year's team? I think you mentioned the three seniors, but uh, talk about each class and, and how many young ladies you think are going to hit the field. Do you have pretty good balance overall as far as each year? I do. I think it's a very good balance. Um, you know, we do expect – our three seniors to lead the way. Um, we, we've had some really impressive freshmen uh, this this year in preseason. Our junior class um, is, you know, we, we've got good, really good numbers there and, and a lot of talent that I think um, 
you know, we, we have nine or 10 juniors, uh, including, you know, a couple transfers. So, um, and then our sophomore class, you know, had a nice year last year, just getting their feet wet and, and, and the majority of them getting quality time. So I think, uh, they have that under their belt and looking forward to, uh, allowing that to propel them forward to this year. Coach, is there a stamp as far as Wilkes University women's soccer, as far as the style that you play, or you know what other teams can expect for you, or uh, and vice versa? You know, I guess you know what you're getting uh, sometimes, whether it's at Misericordia or, or at Kings or some of those schools. Yeah, traditionally, John, we've played a lot of possession on the ground, and um, you know we've done pretty well with that. We're we're really trying to focus on attack this year and just getting. Getting forward early, we're, we're, we've got some really good athletes on this team, and we've got some tremendous speed. So we're going to play a little more direct. We're going to try to get forward early, and we're going to really press teams. We've we've got a, a bunch of kids here that are really fit and uh, a lot of great athletes. So we're going to put pressure on people, and we're going to try to get after them early and, and maintain a high level of intensity throughout the, you know, the 90 minutes. Well, John, we look forward to seeing how your team does during the year. Three seniors at uh, Wilkshire University for the women's soccer program, and as he mentioned, some talented freshmen as well. John, we thank you for your time. Yeah, thank you, John. Appreciate it. Wilkshire University women's soccer here on the John Mandola Show. We are driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers.